A developed nation has a solid infrastructure, a well-functioning administration, a developed economy, a wide range of employment opportunities, comprehensive health and social services, and a high degree of individual freedom. Developing nations are those that barely meet these benchmarks. Regarding to this aspects we have talked about, today we're going to discuss the most developed countries in Africa. Welcome back to Quick Information Post, the number one online information post that helps you understand your world better. In case it's your very first time in this channel please consider subscribing for more amazing content. 1. Seychelles, located 1,500 km off the coast of East Africa, Seychelles is an island nation. The mainstays of the Seychelles economy are tourism, agribusiness, and fishing, with laborers employed mostly in the tourist sector. Despite having the highest GDP in Africa, Seychelles experiences economic inequality and marginalization, which makes some of its residents poor. Africa's most developed nation is Seychelles, which has a zero. 782 Human Development Index Out of 188 nations and territories, it comes in at number 63. The average Seychelles always will have attended school for 14. The nation's GDP per person is $23,886 US dollars. 2. Mauritius, off the southeast coast of Africa, in the Indian Ocean, 2,000 km, 1,200 km, east of Madagascar, sits the island nation of Mauritius. Mauritius, Rodriguez, and Réunion are a component of the Mascarene Islands, a French overseas department. Port Louis, the nation's capital and largest city, is home to the majority of Mauritius inhabitants. Since gaining independence from Great Britain in 1968, Mauritius' economy has developed from a low-income, agriculture-based one to a high-income, diversified one that is centered on tourism, textiles, sugar, and financial services. Fisheries, hotel and property development, healthcare, renewable energy, information and communication technology and education and training have all expanded. Algeria, the largest nation in Africa, Algeria is also in the north and has borders with Tunisia. Although the country is working to diversify its economy to reduce young unemployment, Algeria's economy is still mostly dependent on oil. The Human Development Index for Algeria is zero. Petroleum and natural gas exports from Algeria account for approximately one-third of the nation's annual GDP notwithstanding fluctuations in the price of these commodities on the world market GDP. The economy was mostly based on agriculture and supported the French economy until 1962. Since then, the primary activities that have allowed for quick industrialization have been the extraction and production of hydrocarbons. Tunisia, this northern African country is called Tunisia. The manufacturing, services, tourism, and mining sectors make up Tunisia's economic foundation, with the services sector making up the largest portion of GDP. The World Economic Forum ranked Tunisia the most competitive nation in Africa in 2009. At the end of 2015, Tunisia's Human Development Index was zero. The average Tunisian is expected to live to be 75 years old. According to the 2021 index, Tunisia's economic freedom score is 56.6 placing the nation 119th overall. Libya Libya is a nation in North Africa. The primary driver of the Libyan economy is oil production. Africa's largest oil reserves are in Libya. One of eight African nations that the World Bank has classified as having an upper-middle income economy is Libya. Libya ranked 102 out of 108 countries and territories in the high human development category as of the end of 2015 with a human development index score of zero. One of the highest per capita earnings in Africa is found in Libya. Oil revenue is the main source of income for Libya. Nearly all of the country's income and nearly three-fourths of its energy came from oil and natural gas. 6. Egypt also referred to as the Arab Republic of Egypt, Egypt is a nation that is located on both the Arab and African continents. Egypt is located in southern Asia and the northeastern region of Africa. Egypt's borders are the Gaza Strip and Israel to the northeast, the Red Sea to the east, Sudan to the south, and Libya to the west. Approximately 3 million Egyptians work abroad, primarily in Libya, 
Saudi Arabia, the Persian Gulf, and Europe. Egypt's economy is centered on agricultural, media, petroleum imports, natural gas, and tourism. The economy and resources are still under strain due to the rapidly growing population, the scarcity of arable land, and reliance on the Nile.